fossilized bones of a dinosaur believed to be the largest creature ever to walk the earth have been unearthed in Argentina, paleontologists say. Based on its huge thigh bones, it was 40 meters 130 feet long and 20 meters 65 feet tall, weighing in at 77 tons. It was as heavy as 14 African elephants, and 7 tons heavier than the previous record holder, Argentinus artis. Scientists believe it is a new species of titanosaur, an enormous herbivore dating from the late Cretaceous period. A local farm worker first stumbled on the remains in the desert near La Flecha, about 250 kilometers 135 miles west of Chulu, Patagonia. The fossils were then excavated by a team of paleontologists from the Museum of Paleontology Aguidio Ferruglio, led by Dr. José Luis Carbolido and Dr. Diego Paul. They unearthed the partial skeletons of seven individuals, about 150 bones in total, all in remarkable condition. A film crew from the BBC Natural History Unit was there to capture the moment the scientists realized exactly how big their discovery was. By measuring the length and circumference of the largest femur thigh bone, they calculated the animal weight 77 tons. Given the size of these bones, which surpass any of the previously known giant animals, the new dinosaur is the largest animal known that walked on Earth, the researchers told BBC News. Its length, from its head to the tip of its tail, was 40 meters. Standing with its neck up, it was about 20 meters high, equal to a seven-story building. The new dinosaur is a type of sauropod similar to Argentinosaurus. Illustrated here this giant herbivore lived in the forests of Patagonia between 95 and 100 million years ago, based on the age of the rocks in which its bones were found. But despite its magnitude, it does not yet have a name. It will be named describing its magnificence. And in honor to both the region and the farm owners who alerted us about the discovery, the researchers said, measuring there have been many previous contenders for the title World's Biggest Dinosaur. The most recent pretender to the throne was Argentinosaurus, a similar type of sauropod, also discovered in Patagonia, originally thought to weigh in at 100 tons, it was later revised down to about 70 tons, just under the 77 tons that this new sauropod is thought to have weighed. The picture is muddied by the various complicated methods for estimating size and weight, based on skeletons that are usually incomplete. Argentinosaurus was estimated from only a few bones. The researchers here had dozens to work with, making them more confident that they really have found the big one. Dr. Paul Barrett, a dinosaur expert from London's Natural History Museum, agreed the new species is a genuinely big critter, but there are a number of similarly sized big sauropod thigh bones out there, he cautioned. Without knowing more about this current find it's difficult to be sure. One problem with assessing the weight of both Argentinosaurus and this new discovery is that they're both based on very fragmentary specimens. No complete skeleton is known, which means the animal's proportions and overall shape are conjectural. Moreover, several different methods exist for calculating dinosaur weight. Some based on overall volume, some on various limb bone measurements, and these don't always agree with each other, with large measures of uncertainty. So it's interesting to hear another really huge sauropod has been discovered, but ideally we'd need much more material of these supersized animals to determine just how big they really got.